Hey strangers, so today, exciting, exciting video. It is like 2.37 a.m. and I don't know why I'm up. For those people who work all day, you guys know that when it's nighttime, that's filming time, um, that's free time, that's whatever the fuck you want to do time. Sorry for swearing, but it's true. What I wanted to do was a face fresh impression mask. And this is the Lush Brazen Honey. I've tried cupcake before i've tried um love lettuce before and i've also tried bb seaweed before but i never actually did an official video and i feel like i should start because these masks you know they're interesting they're fresh every time people come into our shops they're always like oh my god is that food can i eat it is there crackers in the back i'm just fake the laughing ah, no there isn't but um, this one is actually really interesting. It, ha it says here, revitalize tired skin with warming Ayurvedic herbs and spices. From what I know and how I explain to customers about this is that brazen honey has a lot of ginger in there. So it's really good for any congested skin and it stimulates the skin. And there's also a lot of honey. So essentially it's good for combo oily skin. And um, let's see what else. There's also limes from what I know, so it's really good for brightening the skin as well and taking away any sort of um, bacteria. Ooh, there's sage leaf extract, kaolin clay, which is perfect, uh, almond shells, which I guess is the exfoliator, and turmeric. I've tried a turmeric mask before from Kiehl's and I really, really like that one, but apparently they're like $40. I'm not sure. Maybe I'll go check out the store one day. So I guess this is like our version of the turmeric mask. So I'm sm oh. I'm smelling it and it does smell a little bit floral. I'm kind of worried because the last time I smelled something like this, it was in the cupcake face mask and I did not like it at all. Like I didn't even leave it on. So um, first of all, we got to take off this makeup off the face because there's no point in doing a deep cleansing mask if you have makeup all over. So I'm just going to take that out. So I've been using the Missler, Garnier Missler water because I hear so many good things about it. And I used to use like tissue paper on it all the time, but now I got these cotton pads, so they are great. So let's take this all off just cuz I have like highlighters and all that jazz in there take everything out and what I like about micellar water if you guys are wondering what is that um, micellar water is basically like a makeup remover but it also cleanses your skin so you don't have to worry about like rinsing off your face after this which is nice and I remember like my previous makeup removers they would kind of sting my eyes a little bit oh look at that nasty they would sting my eyes a little bit but this one is so gentle and i got it when it was on sale at shoppers drug mart so you can get it at any local uh drug store actually i lied my boyfriend ordered for me on wall in walmart when it had a sale so just wipe that all off make sure your makeup is off okay so got the job done sort of so now what I'm gonna do is put this on. Let y'all know what I think. Ooh, right off the bat, I can tell it's gonna be really thick. So let's put that on there. So I'm back, I placed it all over my skin. And right off the bat, I can confidently say that the smell is not as strong as the cupcake which I'm totally fine with that because that floral smell I don't know what it is but there's something in here that makes me makes it smell really nasty but another interesting thing that's in here is eggs I do feel it kind of stinging a little bit which I'm kind of scared maybe it's because I used micellar water and kind of like vigorously took off my makeup I don't know but I am starting to feel that stimulation and it's funny because a lot of customers tell me that they love it so i'm kind of liking it a little bit but it is stinging um there's also loads of honey which i totally forgot to say it's in the name but it's really good for giving you moisture and locking it in so i'm gonna leave it on for maybe until it dries 
Uh, but then I'll get back to you guys before I sh wash it off and uh, let you know what I think. I left it on for a little bit and I noticed that the stingy, um, kind of like burning, stimulating feel kind of ended a little bit. Um, it actually feels really soothing now, so I'm actually gonna go take a quick body shower and I'll be right back to let you guys know what my final thoughts are about these masks. Okay, so I just literally rinsed off my face. I admit I left it on for like another 10 minutes, but I feel like my face is so smooth. Like out of all the other masks I've tried, I feel like this is probably the mask that made my face the smoothest. I don't have to explain it. Like I feel like Mass of Magna Minty was smooth, but it, the Mass of Magna Minty made it feel a little bit um, clean, like squeaky clean, but this one is like a baby's bottom smooth. Like it feels like I put it on some sort of primer. It's crazy. It feels really nice and soft. I feel like um, it took over any sort of unwanted bumps. It makes me want to touch my face over and over again, especially here. You can tell like it's like moisturized, it's not dry. It doesn't feel like my face is tight or anything like that. As you can see, my nose is like, if anything, really shiny. But I'm just going to put um, the serums and stuff that I usually put on at night. If you guys are interested, I can do a night routine. But until I get better lighting and camera and maybe just more virtual um, diverse products, then maybe I'll start. But yes, it just... I do recommend I would buy this again for sure. So this is part of my favorite list now. So love lettuce and albreys and honey. And I forgot to add in, usually with all my masks, haul, or videos, I love showing you guys what the hidden message is in the back. If you guys don't know, there are hidden messages there. So let's check out what the Brazen Honey has. And this was made by Violetta. Thank you, Violetta, for making a beautiful batch. I really enjoyed it. So let's see. Does this, this happen to a lot of you guys? It happens to me says detox not as exciting but still cute i love the idea of this so do pick it up guys i recommend 